ATB Psychic Tarot Channel. Today I am going to ask the spirit guides to bring you information, message and uh, notifications that you really need to know. Many of you come to tarot readings for an answer and today you are going to have the answer. Not by tarot cards, not by intuition, but by spirituality spirit mentors, angel guides, giving you the direction, the answer that you need. Dream is coming through. The dream is coming through. The dream is coming through. I don't know what job you are going to be asked to do. I don't know what business you are going to have a partnership. But I know and I can assure you that what is coming for you is going to make you the richest person of your family. You are going to help them. They are going to admire you. You are going to have uh, the presence of a huge, huge angels, spirit mentor, and I also see someone that you used to care but now is dead watching you from the heaven. And they are so proud of you, so proud of you. Believe me, my dear, believe me. Come here with ATB if you believe that it is about to be accomplished your ever ever dream repeat the spiritual words with me i can i deserve it i receive it i share it and i am thankful and feel this energy of money coming towards you you are going to be a winner you are going to be your a winner. Your heart belongs to heaven. You are the only sign of the zodiac that has a heavenly virtue. Each one has a heavenly virtue. In health, God is going to give you a long life. You have a long walk. You are going to dedicate it something in your life that will bring happiness for you, will bring you whatever financially you deserve. You are going to travel. You are going to meet another land. You are going to have a promotion in your job. You are going to do business with powerful people. I see money in your pocket. I see money in your pocket. Someone is going to trust you and you are going to have an upgrade in your career. Trust your ability, my dear. Trust your ability, my dear. Many people have turned their backs on you when you need them. And now they are going to watch you. And when they watch you, they have to rise up their hand because you are going to be up, up up, up. Something spirit is going to get into you. You are going to receive lucky and money. I see that you are about to start something very new. Or maybe you are going to get a promotion. Because from now on, spirit guides are going to make it happen. People are going to realize all the power, all the knowledge, all the experience, all your gifts, and you are going to have a great opportunity to have a great stability, financial stability in your life. And I keep seeing most of you getting lucky, getting lucky in the lottery games. I always see it, but I always see that most of you don't play. Don't play games. Don't play lottery games. So you are not used to. You should start because you are getting into an energy of lucky 
and opportunities, financial opportunities. In your romantic relationship, you endure everything, even with... Uh, you have a partner that sometimes explodes. <laughs> you have a partner that sometimes explodes. And sometimes uh, you feel like this person is not the right person for you. Because they feel that you are not happy with them, or you feel that you are not happy with them. Somehow your marriage got stuck. Uh, you don't do new things. You don't have a communication. There is no more love, romantic uh, moments, happiness. And uh, you both are asking for yourselves if it is the time to, to commit or to separate. And the, you have to be very careful, okay, on this decision because there is, there is a spell on you. There is a witchcraft on you. And it has been done a long time ago, but it's still getting into your marriage. If you are single, I see that you want to study or maybe you want to finish a study. You are getting into a, building a company. You will interact with peer, people of power. You are going to take cleansing bath, purification of your aura. You are going to do a house spiritual cleansing. And there is something about a stolen inheritance that belongs to you. I think that there is something between your brothers or the brothers of your father or the brothers of your mother that you have something related to an inventory, something that uh, someone who is dead left to them and uh, there is still not being shared. Or maybe you never got the fair that is just for you. There is an injustice in something that should be shared. But what I see here is that divine justice is coming towards you. Divine justice is coming towards you. You are going to meet someone who is going to win your heart. A person who in the past was very important to you let you down. But nevertheless, you forgave him. You forgave her. You are going to meet someone who will be willing to, to have a relationship with you or maybe to continue a relationship with you. I tell you, a person in the past does not rest his soul in peace. This person is dying because no one remembered them, because they did a lot of wrong. Maybe they abandoned. Maybe they left you alone. You are going to fulfill a promise in other lands, and you are going to receive money that belongs to you by nature. I see, my dear, that... Uh, they are going to give you money. You are going to receive money. You are going to make an important negotiation. They are going to give you an advice. There is a dead person who does not rest. And you know why. He's dying. And this person dies definitely when he is forgotten. When he is not remembered. The person does not live. He does not live. The dead who are remembered are those who live in eternity. This person perhaps did a lot of damage, a lot of damage, a lot of pain. He wants you to forgive him. He wants you to forget the past. He wants to get into your life. So I'm talking about two different situations. Sorry, because Spirit Guides sent so many messages that I get 
dizzy here. There are two situations. There is a situation of someone who is dead is asking your forgiveness because uh, once this, this person went, uh, he was alive, there was something that should be sharing between people and you never got your piece of share, okay? And then uh, this spirit wants your forgiveness because maybe this spirit left the whole thing for one person that didn't deserve it and left you with nothing. It could be something related to your parents as well. I see something related to uh, inheritance or maybe something related to, uh, you know, let me see. Uh, they're talking. Uh, they are talking about an uh, inventory. Inventory. Uh, inventory that was not very fair. And this spirit wants your forgiveness. So, just light a white candle and do Psalm 23. And ask God to forgive this soul. It's not up to you to forgive. It's God decision, okay? And the other thing that I see is someone in love that left you. And now this person really, really wish another chance. This is up to you as well. And now I am going to invite you to subscribe, to give him a like, to share. And if you want a private reading and you are a subscriber, you get great discounts. Thank you, thank you, thank you.